Yeah, I'm breathing a little heavy. If you were watching the video yesterday, you know I was climbing up a hill. I'm still climbing. You know, this is a hill that I walked down just about a half an hour ago. And you know what? It didn't take as much energy to go down as it does to go up. But this is the weirdest thing that I observed. On my way down, I was constantly slipping and sliding. On my way up, I haven't slipped once. And one of the things that I've noticed in walking up this hill and in life, when things are easy, it's easier to fall. When things are easy, our guard is down. But when we know things are gonna take work, like climbing up that did, our guard is up. We're more focused. We're more steady on our feet because we're aware of the dangers. Plus, going uphill, you can't be distracted. It's taking all your energy. It's taking your focus, which is a good thing. You know, it's not much different in life. When things are going good, when things are going easy, when everybody's happy with you, it's easier to fall down. It's easier to forget what you're doing, to not be as aware of the dangers. And sometimes they're even greater when things are easy. But when things are difficult, keep your eyes open. See, this is how God uses trials in our life. To focus on Him. He says, don't be surprised when difficult times come. Though something strange is happening. But He also said He's determined at times to bound every habitation that we might seek God. So God is using your trials. God is using the times when you need to be more aware of the dangers and put more work into things. Even if it's not dangerous, just more work. The more work we put in, the more focus we have. The Bible says where your treasure is, there your heart will be also. Where you put your energy, where you put the things of value to you in your life, your heart will follow. So if God's calling you into a time of work, a time of labor, know that this is one of those times that God just wants you to be focused and recognize that he's given you the strength to do what he's called you to do. And it's amazing. Now that I'm at the top, I'm thinking, I'm an old guy and I'm breathing pretty heavy. But God gave me the strength to do what I needed to do. And he'll give the strength to you too. Hope that's been an encouragement to you. God bless. We'll talk to you soon.